On your first time logging into online banking, put in the login ID that you selected at enrollment. Then skip the password this first time and select the box, I am a first time user. Then hit login. Next, you will be brought to a screen that asks you to have a secure code sent to you. You will be asked to have a secure code every six months or more frequently if your computer cleans out cookies more frequently. If you're finding that you're getting asked for a secure code more than you'd like, please call a customer service representative and they'll help walk you through how to save our site as a secure site. You can have a secure code sent as a text message, a voice call, or as an email. I have asked the bank to add my cell phone as a text message option so I will not have to switch to my other screen for my email. I click the red, er, circle and then hit submit. Next I wait 15 to 30 seconds for the secure code to come. This secure code is only good for one time use and for 15 minutes it will expire. Once I get the secure code, I type it in. You will also be asked for a secure code when you log in to a new computer. If you're at a public computer, such as at a hotel, you will then be asked if it is a one-time use computer or a one to recognize. Select in that case that it's a one-time use so it will erase your information when you log out. The next screen I come to is the Family of Bank Online Banking Agreement and Disclosure. Read through this carefully, and if you'd like, you may also print the disclosure. After you've read through the whole disclosure, select either I accept or I decline. The next screen you are brought to shows your personal information. Anything indicated with an asterisk must be filled out. Then hit submit. Now you are asked to select your own password. This password must contain five characters and one must be a number and one a symbol. It can be longer than five characters. Then hit submit. If the two passwords do not match, it will indicate that you have an error and you need to retype. Now you're into your online banking. If accounts are linked, they will show up an account overview. Please call your local branch if you have any further questions and thank you.